City madman Ted Nugent, who is going to make something from his new cookbook, Kill It and Grill It. So tell us. It's the least I can do, yes. Yeah, indeed. no, this is, uh, you're talking about uh, hunting wild game here, killing it. Pure then... protein. God's gift of pure flesh. <laughs> pure flesh. Dana, make a, a joke out of that. Look at that slavage, baby. Kiss the Jeez, flesh. Jeez, I'm getting horny. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's gorgeous. Oh, man, oh, man. This is a big piece of venison right well, here. This is that a giant talking? dead moose or some herbivore of unknown origin. But what we do, first of all, make sure what, everybody... Let's begin. What are we going to uh, make? First of all, you need to get this, Dana. And, John, because of that story, you get this. Uh, okay, right here. All okay. right, everybody armed. All right. And what do we do? Basically, what we do is we eat pure venison at the Nugent house. Just cut a piece of that and stay clear of me. Okay. All right, now See, we go, you go against the grain. <laughs> Oh, stop it, that. Stop that. It's, it's a, a joke. It's a cooking segment. <laughs> anyway, yeah, right. Kill the maggots. Oh. Kill the maggots. <laughs> All right. Now, now. That's carbohydrates, John. We don't need that anyway. John, you just broke the plate. But what we do, Conan. Oh, my God. God. John just broke the plate. That's we a real hammer. Slabs. I thought it was a TV hammer. Hey, it's weird as testicle. Look at that thing. Look at that your ball. All right. Hey. Harvey. <laughs> The whole meaning of the word flesh, doesn't it? Yeah. But what you get is you get these perfect, pure, unbelievable medallions, and you put it in hot olive oil. What are we making? We never said we're what making we're making. Bubble bean piranha a la Colorado moose. Okay. I, I had it for lunch. <laughs> Is there, already bloody here. Up, no, is there piranha or is there moose in this or is it just venison? No, you eat it like a piranha. You masticate and just gobble up the flesh and like I'll the say dog that, that right. you are. Yes, yes, yes. And so basically what you do is you brown that flesh. You gotta start with pure fresh. You gotta be fresh. The Nugent family doesn't take anything fresh. We don't let strangers handle our meat, okay? So you go out and you kill the meat yourself. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You get a, like a deer that you hit on the highway in your car. That's exactly what you I do. You peel it off the bumper, chop it up, and then uh, no, you're ready to go. That's death by Buick. Like we strangers like strangers handle my meat either. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. No, we no, that's, no, all no. We eat. that's all we eat. Is I'm going to sit down. No, 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 I want you two here to okay. witness this. You guys got to taste this stuff. You'll fall in love with me. Mm -hmm. All right. How long have you known Gene Simmons? All I'm right, sorry. now listen. <laughs> Thank you, the band. Long enough. Okay. But what I do is I get all these fresh ingredients. We got ground venison here. We got fresh taters, and I got some carbos for those who want to have How some carbos. How much you want for them taters? <laughs> but mostly we have we have Play natural play. ingredients here. <laughs> the onion finally came out. Stop it! There's going to be the nothing. Running. I don't think anything's going to be cooked during this segment. I don't think any information is going to be all right, given. You guys to American follow TV. me. Follow me. Right, here's what we're going to do. Bam! <laughs> Dana, Dana, add ingredients for me. Start right, here. Add ingredients. Come on. Dana, come on, oh, Dana. Into yeah. the bowl. Come on, Booby. Start what throwing stuff in there. We got the red peppers. Oh, we got these? the green peppers. We got the onions. The we spoons got the, in there. Uh, we got the, all uh, right, we got the uh, scallions. We got, we got grits. We got stuff. <laughs> Oh, you just get in there. Conan, like, get in just here. get. We're cooking Conan. We're cooking Conan. I'm not gonna let you see so the face. So don't boy. do exactly what we did at home. Well, basically, all the ingredients that are in the so book. But we, we take our meals seriously. Unlike this. Yes. We take our meals very seriously. We think that your quality of life comes from quality of fuel. Ah. Makes sense. Yes. For a guitar player, not yeah. bad. So we add pasta, or we add potatoes, or we add rice, but ultimately we come up with this brew. This looks good It's right here. awesome. The, the crew here is, is about to have a, a spiritual orgy of the flesh before our very eyes here. And, and what is it? So, uh, you know, we didn't learn anything from, from that well, part. But uh, somewhere in here is pure ingredients. There's good quality ingredients. There's venison in there. There's pasta in there. There's, uh, oh, what else? Lots of scallions. There's and, a coat and, in and there. Peppers. I gotta wear this for the end of the show now. Oh, auction it off. Here's we <laughs> We have a little white vinegar, uh, and we add a little bit of wine to the meals. But basically, it's about quality control. Yes. You know, I'm 54 years, and I'm having the American dream absolutely out of control because I've always eaten good. And I kill my own food. We're a hunting family. We fish, we trap, we provide our own sustenance. Let me ask you a quick question. Yes. What if, because you have children, what if one of your children came to you and said, Dad, I'm a vegan? That's what I, I, I believe. I slap the living <laughs> down. <laughs> <laughs> there, there's not a chance in hell a that. A kind and understanding father. <laughs> you don't think that would ever happen, but if it did, you don't well, have a problem did, with vegans. I got a lot of friends. Literally, uh, my damn Yankee blood brother, Tommy Shaw, is a vegan. 
It's his choice. I make him a salad. Big deal. Right. You know what, Ted? I'm a moronic vegetarian. I just eat meat. Good night. <laughs> That's all I eat. <laughs> Dana, I like the little part afterwards. Well, Dana, Dana all, I, all I eat is vegetarians. That's all I eat. <laughs> No, so, uh, so you have yeah. no problem with, 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 with that choice. If, if Paul McCartney came here, I'd make him some damn tofu and tell him to shut up and sing. You right. know what I mean? Right. It doesn't right. bother me Black at all. Blackbirds sing in the dead of night. <laughs> <laughs> and ultimately, you come up with good quality grits. <laughs> I know. I'm going to give this to Max Weinberg and my blood brothers of the Rhythm me, of Blues look, American. Do you guys want to taste this? You should taste this. It's really good. I want Get a plate. Now, come on, guys. Get one of The one that John didn't break. Let me have a piece of plate. Yeah. Yeah, slap it on that, noons. Just a little uh, for Just me. a little noogie. All right, I'm scared to death. What are you going to do? Just a tiny bit. I'll put a little on that right there. Yeah. Oh. This is how we eat in my country. This is great. Yeah, give me some of the head. I want the brains and the liver. <laughs> All right, well, the, uh, the book right here is called uh, Kill It and Grill It, and you'll really learn what to do if you look at the book. You won't learn from us. Ted Nugent, wow. thank you very much. You're a good man.